It seems like mm. there is a happy ending okay. in sight for 56-year-old Christian mm. Potkhitar. Until Friday, Potkhitar had been isolated in the Namib Desert, about 18 kilometers outside Valfes Bay, in a dilapidated caravan. Potkhitar was ready to die because he suffers from three different types of cancers devouring his body. The health ministry and the Irongo police have come to his rescue with paramedics which were dispatched on Thursday and Friday to search for Potkhitar in the desert. He seems a bit unstable, but as I could see, I saw that huge but massive growth that is obvious cancer on his chin. I went in, spoke to him in his mother tongue, like which is Afrikaans, and we came to an understanding that I will, we can take him off to the hospital. The paramedics told Potkhitar that he might be transferred to a state hospital in Ventuk for chemotherapy. He was saying to me that he thought he will die, and I told him, no, this is not your time, that's why we've been dispatched here. So for you is to get better. If you find any person in that situation, the best thing that you can do is contact any cancer association office or any community policing officer to give you assistance so that you can assist that certain person. Port Hitter's extended family drove from Tsumeb on Friday morning to rescue the elderly man. It's out of the heart. I saw it on, on YouTube and a colleague of mine told me about him on the news. And I just, I went to my parents and to everybody and told them we should come and come get him and treat him and get him better and everything. With police escort, Potkhitar's relatives have moved his caravan from the desert to another family member in Valfes Bay to wait for him to recover fully. Renata Ringura, NBC News, Namib Desert.